first in drug case. In the morning of 4 March 2015, the prisoner had been protected and out of Bali to execution area in Nasukambangan, Iceland, where the firing squad take place. According to CNN News, the Bali 9, nine Australian drug dealers were arrested in the resort Iceland of Bali. Andrew Chan, 31 years old, known as Ring Reader of the Blood, while Miran Sukumalan, 33 years old, was Chan's alliance. And other seven people that involved in the plan, police caught four people at the airport with more than 8 kilograms of heroin stabbed in their body out of Bali and heading to Sydney in 2005. In addition, other four people, including Muran, were arrested at the hotel. However, Chance was traveling to Sydney, Australia without any drugs. Mr. Tony Abbott, the Prime Minister of Australia, tried to relieve their citizens' punishment from Mr. Joko Widodo, the President of Indonesia. He was denied. Joko said the execution will go forward, though there will be blame for the countries. He pointed out that the Indonesia is facing drug addiction in population. Mr. Joko Widodo firmly tends to his principle to be tough on those who found guilty of just crime. Foreign government should not interfere in the right of execution of those that commit illegal against Indonesian law, said Widodo. I'm here with Ms. Pantayamua. According to the news in Indonesia, that drug dealer moved the drug out of Bali and Indonesia court judged these two pairs to death penalty. Do you think death penalty should be banned or and why? Uh, I think that death penalty is a good way to punish people and it should be banned forever. Uh, uh, many people believe that death penalty helps in reducing crimes in our society, but it is not true at all. Um, the crime committed in our society, it is usually happens when the economy is getting really bad. And when it is getting bad, people tend to face more like struggles and they tend to commit the crimes. So if you want to fix that kind of problem, it, uh, it should be fixed from the start. Like, uh, why the people tend to commit crimes, not just to like... Uh, and another one said that penalty should be banned. So, what kinds of punishment are suitable for drug smuggling dogs and why? Uh, I think a uh, person without a parole is more suitable than the penalty because I think the effects of uh, in person then is much more severe than the penalty. And Another reason is that it is cheaper than uh, putting them into the And also, uh, if you like, uh, if innocent people were put into jail, they are not going to be killed, and they can have a chance to like back with themselves. How about imposing a fine? I think uh, imposing a fine, if only you imposing a fine, it is not going to be suitable for it. You have to like uh, put them in jail and also imposing a fine to make it more suitable. The last question is, if drugs become legal in every country around the world, what do you think will be happening in the future? Uh, I think that most of the countries are going to collapse. The economics will start to fail and the death toll will increase. There will be more crimes in our society because you know the uh, when using drugs people can't control themselves and their actions and the disadvantage of using drugs are very dangerous and can cause people to death. If we don't have rules against Using drugs, it will be terrible in the future. So
So this thank you to Miss Pan Balia Mula. Thank you. Should the penalty be banned? Uh, in my opinion, I don't think that death penalty should be banned because when people are being penalized to death, it means that he has been doing some very bad thing. So he should he deserve to be dead. So what kind of punishment are suitable for smuggling drug? Um, I mean, instead of death penalty. Uh, <clears throat> I, I don't know what other penalty they should get, but in my opinion, I still agree that death penalty is suitable for drug smuggling because drug, smug, drug smuggling will cause several cons bad consequences to many people. If drugs become legal in every country, what do you think will be happening in the future? I think if drug becomes legal, it will cause several bad consequences because drug leads to several crimes, robbery, or many bad things. So I don't agree at all with this issue. So thank you very much, thank you. This is ICE Breaking News, Latiyagon Harmatanagit, report.